Hey everybody, it's BJ. And Patrick. And guess what? We are at an art show on Bear Mountain. Yeah, and with our good friend. Yeah, Ruth Hopkinson, who is a realtor, and I do another podcast with her as well. She is, uh, she's got a presentation today up here on Bear Mountain. We're standing in front of one of her pieces right behind us there, but we're going to have a walk through here. We're going to have a chat with Ruth at some point as well, and... Uh, We'll talk to you guys later. Yeah, looking forward to that. There's 28 pieces that she's got on okay. display here. All right, and, uh, and but there's more, uh, and but we'll get into that with Ruth. Uh, okay, in a few minutes. All right, okay. See you guys. So what an amazing event so far. Uh, Ruth now isn't as busy as she was with all her guests that came to the art exhibit. How did it go? It was fabulous. It was so much fun and looking forward to doing it again. And uh, I, I didn't count all the pieces, but you had about 28 pieces here on display. 22 on, on display. Lover. I had 22 pieces here. Um, and some of them are quite large. Some of them are quite big. And yeah, it's... Uh, it, I, I, I sold one, and it was a fabulous turnout. Oh, wonderful. Um, so was that the favorite one from people's comments? The well, it was the one I least expected to sell. It was a self-portrait of me and a big one, a three-foot one, and uh, didn't wasn't expecting that one to go. But sometimes um, the way that I, my art shows typically go, if I choose a favorite, the one I don't want to sell, that's the one that's going to sell. Oh, I think I know who bought that one. Yeah, we were talking about that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it, it was good. It was great, and and I've gotten stuff from it as well. So that's amazing. Um, for people that maybe are unfamiliar, how would you describe uh, your paintings? My paintings. Uh, well, those ones are. It's my Bear Mountain series, and so I paint acrylic on canvas, and I paint. Those are an abstract landscape. So. When I go up and climb the mountain, um, there's heart-shaped rocks. There's I'm, I'm catching the colors of the of the, of the sunrise or, or the sunset, mm -hmm. and so I'm just trying to capture everything. And then views of the golf course and views of of looking down from the top of the mountain. So that's amazing. And I know you went to uh, school here in Uvic while you had other opportunities for uh, some big name, exciting schools. I did. I was accepted back in the day, uh, back in the late 80s. I'm going to date myself, but I was accepted to Emily Carr and I was accepted to an art school in the south of France. And Uvic was where I chose to go and love Victoria and happy that I chose Victoria and uh, yeah. Uh, you chose Uvic over France. I did. I, 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 I sure did and loved it. Loved it. Ne I would do it again in a heartbeat. Amazing. Uh, if anybody wanted to find out more about your paintings, how would we find you? Well, I, I have my, uh, my website is hopkinsonart.ca. Um, people can can email me. Um, it's it's hopkinsonart at gmail.com. Um, also, if if people are apt uh, coming up to Bear Mountain, um, my paintings, my abstract landscapes, I have five of them in Jack's Cafe, and I also do uh, pet portraits, and those are at the new Growlies on Bear Mountain Parkway. And Growlies is actually having their grand opening this Saturday from one to three. So. I have seven paintings in there as well. So my cards are all there. Um, so my contact information is on them. Very exciting. And on your website, it's not just your art there, but what you do and your passion as well, right? Yeah, so uh, I've kind of gotten into dual branding. So all my business cards have my, my, my real estate card on one side and on the back side is my artist card and my website runs the same so if someone goes under under my hopkinsonart.ca they're going to land onto my real estate 
website. So don't, do, don't be confused. Do, don't be confused. Yeah. Just look for the artist tab and that takes you right to the art site. That's exciting. Well, thank you for uh, letting us interview you and uh, I hope all the success or I wish all the success thank you. to you. Thanks for coming. Thank you. Thanks. Hey, thanks for joining us. We had a great time here. Hope you enjoyed uh, looking at some of the art that we have here and also our chat with Ruth. Um, did you have a favorite thing? Uh, actually, there's a couple pieces here that really stood out for me. Different styles of yeah. uh, Ruth's paintings. Yeah. Uh, and I'll leave a description in the... I'll leave a description. I'll leave all the details in the description below. If you're interested in any of the art, uh, it'll be there and uh, Ruth's contact information. Yeah, we had a great time. Thank you for joining us again. Uh, please take a minute and subscribe. We're doing more and more community events. So if there's something that you think would be worthwhile for us to get out, uh, we'd love to go, right? Absolutely. So let us know and we'll see you next time. Catch you in the next video. See ya.